Hey guys, Ron White here, the memory guy. What do you think about my shirt? You like it? I uh, This has been in my closet for several years. I've never worn it for obvious reasons. The real question is, is what was going through my head the day that I bought it? I have no clue. I I'm going to give you today some brain exercises. Um, these are just things to, to get your brain moving, uh, to kind of wake up your brain and stimulate your brain. Kind of quirky, <laughs> which is why I'm wearing these quirky shirts. So I'm going to show you some quirky brain exercises. You may want to try them, uh, have some fun, and wake up your brain. The first brain exercise is called brain yoga. Take your left hand and grab it to your right ear. Take your right hand and grab your left ear and put your feet together. And when you go down, exhale, excuse me, inhale. And when you come up, exhale. Do that at 15 or 20 times. It's supposed to kind of, what it's supposed to do is, 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 uh, Get your both sides of your brain in sync. Get both sides of your brain working together and uh, synchronize your brain. So left hand, right ear, right hand, left ear, feet together. There you go. That's the first weird brain exercise that I'm gonna show you. The second one's kind of fun. This is kind of a brain teaser. Try this. I want you to put one of your hands with a pinky out like this the pinky sticking out like this, and then one hand with the thumb sticking up like this, all right? Now switch. Now switch. Now switch. Now switch. And just keep doing that until you can see how fast uh, that you're able to do that. The third brain exercise that I'm going to show you to kind of to, to get your brain sharper or quicker or learn something new is juggling. And I have nothing here to juggle, and it's a good thing because I can't juggle. But scientists tell us that if we can learn how to juggle, it actually wakes up parts of our brain and keeps our brain quicker. At the, at the World Memory Championship in 2009 at the break, I saw this girl juggling. And uh, she was juggling in between memory events just to keep her brain active and sharp and, and, and quick. The last weird, quirky memory exercise I'll give you is, your, is something you can do to focus. Here's the exercise. Get yourself a stopwatch. And then I want you to, you will think of a color and then you will think of a shape, a square, a rectangle, a triangle, anything like that. So think of, a, for example, a blue square. And then close your eyes and push start on the stopwatch and focus on that blue square. Anytime something else enters your mind other than a blue square, if it's your mom, if it's your dad, if it's your job, if it's your relationships, if it's, uh, if it's the weather outside, if it's schoolwork, anytime the, your favorite sports team, any, uh, uh, your favorite actor, anything that enters your brain that is not a blue square, stop the stopwatch and see how long you're able to focus on that one single thought. If the blue square changes shapes or if it changes colors or if it starts to morph, stop the clock. You want to see how long you can focus on one object that's one specific color and just see how long you can go and see how long you can get better and better and, and better and better at that. And it doesn't have to be a blue square. You think of the shape, you think of the color, and maybe vary it up too so uh, it's, it's, it's different for your brain every time. But there's four real quirky memory brain exercises just like this is a quirky shirt. My name's Ron White, two-time USA memory champion. Visit me at brainathlete.com. Good talking with you today. Adios.